I'm going to celebrate my birthday even more by putting one soap pod in hot water, 100%. Here we go. And I think it probably dissolves a little bit better when it's in hot water. Like, look at it. You see, it's just, it's just floating around. Right now. Let's see if I can try picking this up. Ready? Oh my gosh, whoa. And the water is nice and 100% hot. But that's not all yet, guys. We still got more. So I'm going to fill it with a little bit more water and the fun will begin. And I know this video may be a little dark since I'm right here, but you can still, still see the machine. Oh, and one thing I forgot to mention is that whenever someone takes a shower, I should not use a lot of hot water. But right now, it's still pretty early. It's only 6.06 p.m. right now. Anyways, for probably like 20 more seconds, I'm going to start it, or probably 10 more. You know what? I think it's getting up. So anyways, here we go. Oh my gosh. Look at that. Oh, yes. And I also, also, I hope you really enjoyed the video I did, I did yesterday, and it was uploaded today. And I also wanted to say a big thanks to all the people that wished me a happy birthday. I really appreciate it. I'm not going to mention people's names because I don't want them to realize that I I mentioned them. So, but I just want to give a big thanks to all who wished my birthday. Oh, we're, we're getting hot on the glass now. Look at that. I think my machine treats me well. I think my machine has been treating me well lately. Grab my phone, I'll be back. And after I come back, I'm gonna drain the water. Okay, I'm back, and I'm going to start draining after these last two. Holy cow, we're hot. Ouch. I don't want to... 
oversets this this machine. Oh, we're starting to get a little water. But I am exactly sure it's gonna sound. It's gonna sound very interesting. Oh, we're going down. Look right here. Anyways, let let's see how you do, Sammy. hear that water is really thick and when the washer pumps out I'm gonna probably let it do a couple of tumbles to prevent the washer from suds locking so you'll probably see what I mean though Some suds probably got stuck since since I let it soak a bit. I think we're gonna spin, guys. Hey, it's on the right spot. All right, let's put it on spin mode and let's see how it does. Come on, Sammy, please do it. There you go. You see that handle really good. That was a lot better. So far all the suds are probably all dried up. How did that got rid of a lot of that suds off? I'm I'm hyper impressed, by the way. Okay, so we're gonna let that spin a bit. I'm recording like eight minutes now.
soccer in. So I'm gonna rinse it out and see if I can rinse the put, get the rinse the drain pump out. So I'm gonna be using this. I'll put it in the machine, but I wanna like try to spray rinse the suds, uh, so so I'm gonna probably put the spray on while it's still coasting down. But right here, as you can see, so far almost every suds are gone because there's only they only still remain in the window because because the air is just blowing it. Alright, rinse time. Okay, now I'm gonna, okay, I'm gonna stop here. Oh, sorry, that was my phone. I just, I decided to change the notification through my, through my, um, for Thanksgiving. Oh, what? Oh, the door's still locked. Okay. Oh wait, I'm gonna actually fill a little bit of water. Oh yeah, it's still hot. I think I'm gonna let it fill. So as you can see right here, we're starting to cool down because it's because the because this it's this is cold water and it's and it's cooling down. You guys wanted to show me. Alright, son. I got I gotta I, I I gotta text my I gotta tell check my messages. I'm not sure why this. I'm not sure why this setting I'm using when I press cold, the cold option, it does this type of spray and it sprays really slow. I see why it takes forever for small look for like when I do like bigger loads of laundry. some fabric softener in. So I'm going to pour some in a cap. Now I'm going to open the door. Well, this side is cold, but this side is still pretty warm. But We'll get it. We'll get it nice and cool down. I promise. Now I'm smelling something right now. I'm not sure what that smell is. But maybe the downy can't help. So let's go ahead and do that and pour it in. Oh my gosh! This is probably one of the most satisfying things to do. So, let's, I'm going to dissolve those first. 
And then I'll probably put a little more water in. starting to cool down now. Uh, yeah, I know it's kind of hard to see because of the fabric softener, but let's see. Look at that. Alright, I'm just going to fill up cold water because for the rinses it uses cold water. I know this is kind of boring for you guys to watch. I think I'm going to put timestamps for the video. Yeah, I'm not sure why the fabric softener can actually make it foggy. Bless me, guys.
believe it uses like so much power. Like, it was like, like pretty loud. So I'm gonna turn the light on. I want to be like a close listen to the to the drain pump, and it's gonna sound very interesting. During the main wash, it was really quiet, but. Like, during the first drain, it was really quiet, but it's going to sound loud. It's going it's to sound pretty loud when I press drain. So anyways, here we go. Last first. 
then I'll end this video. Well, there you go, guys. I hope. So, I also want to say a big thanks to all the 
You wished me a happy birthday. I don't know what that stuff is. I'll probably get rid of that. Alright. Hope you guys have a hope you guys have a had a great week and I hope you guys have a great weekend. Peace out everybody. And thank you, Sammy.